So it's been about two months since I started on this project. Overall, I'd say it was a success. Um, I got about 10 that are still alive. Could have been better, could have been worse. They're very active, they're very hungry. Uh, they seem to be happy. And they're growing quite fast. They're getting to be uh, near the size of, of most of my red, red cherry shrimp. white dots that you see, those are uh, from my near-eye snail, quite prolific. That's probably uh, the biggest of them so far. It's hard to see how big he actually is. You see my Rudolph shrimp there in the background. I also wanted to show you uh, the, the tool I used to get the shrimp out of the saltwater tank once they're fully formed. I was using uh, a pipette, as you can see here, uh, to start, but that wasn't really doing the trick. So I hooked up a, pu uh, a tube and a solder sucker um, to get quite a bit more suction. And here is one of the shrimp uh, after he's been caught. Now this was just today. Now I have a feeling that this is actually not an Amano shrimp. I, f I think that this could be a Rudolph. You be the judge, but if you look at this close up, I think he looks very different than the Amanos. Another reason why I don't think this is an Amano is due to how long it took to turn into a shrimp. We're two months out and, and weeks apart from any of the Amano shrimps turning. I'll be keeping my eye on this one. 